autumn, that teen, Jerry Chambers Jr., says he wants justice after some people posted pictures on social media of this alleged hate crime back in September 2020. Today, the Chambers family gathered with community members and advocates to call on law enforcement to investigate this incident properly. Chambers says some people wrote racial slurs on his head in Sharpie. There was also a Confederate flag and other items draped over him. The Powhatan Sheriff's Office says Chambers was intoxicated and unconscious at a house party when this all went down. Pictures were taken of Chambers and were posted to Snapchat. He says the trauma would lead him to try and take his own life. Two days later, his parents went to Chesterfield Police and to the Powhatan Sheriff's Office. The agency said the family either didn't want to investigate it or they weren't sure about filing a report. However, the family says they brought all necessary evidence to law enforcement and they want them to bring whoever is responsible to justice. Being a victim of a hate crime definitely scars you for life. It takes away your human rights and for me, it felt like I lost my manhood. To support y'all bringing me now. Wow. It gives me hope to know that this is not going to go without something being done. Now, Chambers says he's been in therapy since this incident has happened. The FBI has been investigating this incident since earlier this year, and now the Petersburg Commonwealth Attorney's Office is now investigating this case since last week. Live in Richmond, Nicole Dantzler, 8 News.